The acknowledgement and the honour of being given an honorary doctor by the university that have graduated from myself, you know, is an incredible honour and one that I'm very, very conscious of. I suppose I'm also conscious of the fact that it's a recognition of not just my own achievements, but that of the, the group of players and management and backroom team that I've been working with for a long number of years now. And I think that's actually a quite important gesture in many ways too, because of the impact what the lads have done over the last uh, six years has had on uh, not just their own lives, their clubs, but the community and Limerick City and county as a whole as well. And I suppose finally then I'd say, you know, from my own family perspective, it's, it's, it feels surreal almost, to be honest with you, to be here. You know, an incredible honour for me to have my mum and dad here, you know, during their 80s, and for them to be well and healthy and happy and able to be here with us today. It has been a great journey for them to be a part of, my own wife and, and girls as well. On a personal level, it's, 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 it's a great day for us as a family, and I feel extremely honoured and privileged. I was involved in UCC in the establishment of scholarships down there. Number one, I'm delighted their skill and their ambition and talent is being acknowledged by the university. I think it's hugely important. I suppose in terms of advice for them, I suppose they're young. They need to try and take stock and appreciate the moment and try and live for that moment to do the very best that they can in that moment because that's all they can actually control. Try not to look too far down the road because, you know, you might miss out the journey while you're doing it.